every story from every person in history that has done something great, significant, every single one of them starts with hello. Hello. Frizzy. My name is Frizzy, and I'm a rapper. I like to call it MC. <laughs> And hip hop and uh, rap and being an MC, it's all in the same family. Being a rapper is more uh, in the entertaining category. Can't stop, young gun, won't stop. Free rap, won't stop. I'll cut your rap. Chop, chop. Well, you have your dance songs and your party songs, lyrical ability. But I think being an MC, the master of your ceremony and being able to conduct and control the crowd, being able to lyrically take them where you want to take them, and you control their ears and their eyes and their imagination. I think that's what being an MC is. Cause I ain't mad at ya, just let me have at ya. Man, I hope they seeing this. Hip hop is a culture as well, right? There's so many things that come within it. Rap is one of the categories within that culture. I started rapping my backstory, the beginning of me. Here in Pittsburgh, I was really into basketball and then playing and going to college to play. My mom and dad, when they raised me, I didn't really listen to hip hop a lot. Uh, I listen to Will Smith all the time. I could probably rap every Will Smith lyric <laughs> in the world. Check, 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 check. My friends knew I could rap or freestyle, and they entered me into this contest, and I won the contest and got a chance to work with John Gore. From there, I ended up signing with a management group and really going out to New York. I knew I could freestyle a lot. I knew I could make words rhyme really quickly, and I was always able to think two sentences ahead of what I was doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Met with John Gore, and he put me in the booth, and I didn't know how to write a song. At the time, I just learned that I could rap, so I was just excited to rap about anything. Sometimes it didn't even make any sense, so I had to focus on making sure that the content was consistent and being patient. Like, okay, this is 16 bars, this is how you judge what a bar is, And but because of that, I think because I went through that intense training, it helped me become a better songwriter because I was able to appreciate the nuance and the, and the little, the cadence it switches and what makes this important. And okay, if I'm a listener and I'm listening, what entertains me? They say they the next up. I didn't heard the talk, but when they up the bat, they more shot in the Plus, I'm a big R&B guy. I can't sing. Terrible singer. Except for when I'm in the shower, I'm like Michael Jackson. But <laughs> listening to those types of songs and the stories that came with R&B songs helped me to become a better MC as well, which is, you know, ironic. I'm in the 412, so it's FU2 with my FU crew and LTQ. Thank you, I gotta thank you. Our relationship with DJ Wonderboy has been something special for me. It's taken my career to a whole nother level. I've been able to accomplish things and do things I've never thought I've been able to do just from his support and him believing in me and trusting me as an artist. He's the Dane Dash to my Jay-Z, the, the Diddy to my Biggie, and it, it makes me better. Within this industry, sometimes success is stingy. People like to hold that to themselves. I promised myself when I was at that point, I was like, you know, if I ever make it to where I want to make it, I am going to give back as much as possible. I'm going to give all this information I have. So when I'm here, I've been going to all the Pittsburgh Public Schools with Arts Greenhouse and sitting down with them and CMU and, and all the students there as well and really talking and answering any questions. I mean, it's, it's a funny thing. You know, your parents say, um, I'm doing, you know, I understand now, but I'm doing this because it make it easier for you, right? And that's what I'm doing now. So anything that I tell them, I hope that their journey is a lot easier than mine, where I hope their road is paved with a lot less potholes. <laughs> All right, do it one time. Okay. The future is looking very bright. I have my sunglasses on, I'm excited. I'm dropping my first album, you know, full length nationwide. Big in stores, official um, LP. Um, it's called God King Slave. The first single is called Ouija and it's out now so people can get it and, and listen to it. And it's something different. I wanted to make sure lyrically that I stepped up to another level. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Listen. Yo. Man, I used to ask my one OG. Why I stare at the stars like TMZ? He like OMG, FRE. You would put him on his surf for that ENT. You about to blow like TNT. I hear nah just to say I agree. But you gon' gonna have to leave, so just be RB. And don't forget your home base, do like the MLB. And when I see you on that TV screen, I know I better get access, boy, like EBT. So I can watch you kill rappers, call the EMT. F guns are all bars, baby, UFC. That's why I murder all these rappers with the words I speak. Why you think they yelling SOS? Cause the team's got text, no SMS. Cause they here to protect the kid like CYS. Did that go? Over your head, homie, no PS. PS, that was a big punch, no TS. The diamonds are raw, BBS. So talk ish and I block and blew your eye like CBS. Very funny, homie, TBS. The mid TBH, cause the flow.
flow ain't great, homie, your flow ain't me. I'm a real MC. Question W Y T, cause my dog group of brown lights ain't from LBC. But everybody know them boys up to PIT. So if you say at my city, homie, we'll all see. You trying to get the beat got like NBC. God damn. I'm just an ETA, cause I'm here, and you about to go in my A. Since I got rid of blue face and all you. If you can't tell, that's why the PC more than my URL. That's why I add low well. Cause on the south side, I be on Carson Daily like TRL. And you can catch me riding in that new SL. All red pins got me like a bat out of hell. Cause with a pin, I work like an ATM. That's why this whip got him begging for some SL. <laughs> and to be real, I don't ask with them. I stay with my click, they trying to find a BPM. My dude. Now they take me serious like X and Nick. That's just a FYI. Hope that not FBI. Hope that not TMI. You think you right? Well, let me see your BMI. But this note, I see through you. Beat the MR crowd. Right. Cause I'm bored. And I ain't talking really serious. Cause I'm bored. And I ain't talking really serious. I'm bored, and I ain't talking really serious. Cause I'm bored, and I ain't talking really serious. Yeah. <laughs> <Cool>. <laughs> no, no, no.